So here we go, brand new wheels for the red eye. What do you guys think I ended up going with? Oh my God, the car looks so great. I'm gonna show you guys the new wheel and tire setup. I am super excited today. I am finally fixing a problem that I have been having with the Red Eye for a very long time. Good morning and welcome to the channel. I am Corey and this is Driveway Demons. So I went ahead and got a new wheel and tire setup for the drag strip and racing in the Red Eye as it's a much needed setup. I cannot wait to share with you guys the new wheels and tires I chose for the Red Eye. I know I was taking a vote on which tires and wheels to go with, so I'm going to reveal to you guys right now exactly what that setup is gonna be. So here we go, brand new wheels for the red eye. What do you guys think I ended up going with? Put your comments down there below. Which wheels do you guys think that I went with for the red eye? I'm so pumped. Oh my God, this is gonna be so great to finally be able to have some sort of traction in the red eye. So here we go. I went with brand new factory demon wheels as their 18s. I truly like the look of the Demon wheels. Now, I did a vote between the Demon and Weld wheels and the Demon wheels won that vote. So that's what I went with. And not only that, I really like the Demon wheels better. Anyway, today we're gonna get them installed and see exactly how well they perform on the street. I'm gonna show you guys which tires I went with. All right, guys, the new tires I went with are a lot better than the ET Street SS tires plus their 18s. Which tires do you guys think I went with? Leave your comments below. What tire do you think that I put on the Demon Wheels? I'm getting ready to reveal it to you guys right now. I'll give you a second to put your comments below. They are bad tires. I'll tell you guys what, they are so bad. I cannot wait to see how well they perform and I'm sure you guys are gonna love them. All right guys, here is the tire setup that I'm going with on the Demon Wheels. So there we go, 305, 45, 18 Street R's. Now, these are supposed to be the best tires you can have on the drag strip. Now, the Street SS tires are actually street tires for the drag strip, whereas the Street R's are drag tires that are barely street legal. So, they are supposed to be a lot better. I haven't used these tires before. But we are going to see if they're truly a lot better than the 20s that I was running. And it's real meaty. They definitely have a lot more meat than the 20 inch wheels and tires. So, Let's go ahead and get all this loaded up in the car, get over to the Honda dealership where my buddy Rich works and get these mounted and see how well they're gonna handle this much power on the street. And not only that, we're gonna test the Toyos on the way there because I haven't even done that yet. Now, it's a good thing my seat is out. Otherwise, I really wouldn't have a whole lot of room to get these wheels and tires in the red eye. So we're looking good for today. It's time to get out of here and go see how these Toyos perform, get these tires mounted on the Demon wheels. And we're gonna find out how much better my traction truly is going to be with this new setup. So let's get out of here. Oh wait, you thought I was not gonna do a cold start? Alright guys, they got the car out of the shop and it looks amazing. Sorry about the wind noise. It's kind of windy today, but oh my God, the car looks so great. I'm going to show you guys the new wheel and tire setup. Here we go. So there you have it guys, the Mickey Thompson Street R's on the Demon 18 by 11s. It looks so good. What do you guys think? It is just so sick. I don't even know what to say. It, it's just so awesome. And I cannot wait to see how well these tires hook. It is time to take this car for a ride and see if these tires outperform the Mickey Thompson ET Street SS tires. And from this angle, it looks unbelievably good. 
it's definitely looking beastly that's for sure guys that is definitely for sure wow I'm really thinking about getting demon wheels. I really am for the front. Yep, I'm gonna have to do the front as well. It just looks so good. All right, so it is time to test out the Mickey Thompson tires. As you can see, I'm back home and I apologize. I could not run the car again to test the tires. I was running out of time today. I'm preparing for the slipstream event tomorrow. And as you guys can see, it hooked pretty damn good with these tires on the first run. Didn't have to heat them up. They have no miles on them and they pretty much dead hooked. There was a very slight spin and I mean very slight between the second and third gear shift. And it was awesome. It felt great. Definite improvement over the Mickey Thompson ET Street SS tires and a pretty big improvement over the Toyo Proxies, which is saying a lot. These tires are definitely the choice if you are making serious power with your Challenger or Charger, pretty much any car you have. And I really like the red eye wheels, but I just like the demon wheels even more now that I see it on the car. And I can't fit the demon wheels up front yet. So I'm gonna have to do a brake conversion if I wanna get the demon wheels up front as the brake calipers are just too big. But I really like how this looks for now. And like I said, I really am thinking about getting another set of demon wheels. I think it would look really awesome. Do you think I should go with a set of demon wheels in the front to match the rear? I really want to do that, but like I said, I got to do a brake conversion up front because these calipers are too big. The way these wheels and tires mesh together and give that nice staggered, beefy look in the rear is just terrific. It's just unbelievable. I never thought it would look this great. I'm really shocked, honestly, how well it looks and, and flows with the car. And you guys are going to start seeing exactly what this red eye can really do. And like I said, I'm so pumped to finally have a proper wheel and tire setup for the power I'm making. Some other companies have sponsored me and I'm not going to tell you guys about that just yet so stay tuned i have a few other companies that are going to be helping me out get some more power and reliability out of the car it's going to be downright nasty well it already is nasty it's going to be even nastier with all these future mods that are planned in the next couple of weeks but stay tuned for those mods guys you're going to love it and i want to give a big shout out to the guy who sponsored me on these wheels and gave me the hookup Demonic Alloy on eBay. I'm gonna put his link down there in the bottom of the screen as well as a link in the information box below. Check him out on eBay, Demonic Alloy. I'm gonna have all that information below. Well guys, that's gonna do it for today's video. I'm hoping you guys enjoyed it. New wheel and tire setup for the Red Eye, the Green Devil, finally being able to put all that power to the ground. And that's exactly what I've been lacking lately and I fixed it. I told you guys I would and now there's gonna be no more spinning when I'm racing people. So I really appreciate you guys watching. Don't skip the ads, support the channel, check out the store, drivewithdemons.com, key tags, hoodies, t-shirts, hats, all kinds of stuff and more, as well as below this video, some of my merchandise is there. You guys can purchase it. That supports the channel. And to anybody who does, thank you so much for all your support. If you're stopping in for the first time, go ahead and subscribe, thumbs up, comment below. What do you guys think of this video? Be sure to share it with everyone. The Green Devil has got new shoes. Don't forget to check out my brother's channel this can't be happening all lowercase one word and check me out over on twitch twitch.tv forward slash driveway demons lots of after hours gaming content and more like i said i got a giveaway coming up but i've had to change a few things around with all these events so stay tuned for that as well and lots of mods coming on the red eye i'm going to be ceramic coating the truck next week so stay tuned for that 
the truck is finally gonna get some love that it deserves. So I got some more Duramax content coming at you guys as well. That is gonna do it, guys. Take care, have a great day, and I will see you on the next video. Take care, bye-bye.